Hello, I'm Robin Michael, guest principal cello uh, for the Academy of Ancient Music for this upcoming project uh, concerning Bach's sons. So this project is particularly interesting for me because there are two solo cello pieces in the programme, a sonata by GCF Bach and uh, the much more well-known uh, concerto in A major by C.P. Bach. And this project, Stephen Nicholas is the soloist, wonderful cellist I've known for many years. Himself was writing at the, the very end of the, the Baroque period, whereas his son, C.P. in particular, it was very much the beginning of the Enlightenment period. Uh, the music of the church was seen by those composers to be sort of boring and old hat, and they were concerned with much more sort of flamboyant music. C.P. Bach still sounds sometimes like modern music. It's extraordinary. And he's obviously rebelling against his father. So it's not that it was unimportant that he was Bach's son, but he's certainly no imitation of his father. He's worlds away. C.P. Bach in particular was, was influenced much more by the Italian school, by Vivaldi. Uh, hard to think now with obviously the tiring influence of what his father must have been. Uh, but C.P. Bach worked at the court of King Frederick the Great, who was very much... Uh, obsessed with, with things new. He had inventors at the court as well as the, the, the young writers of the time. C.P. Bach was very clear that music must express emotions and he certainly does. It's a very exciting piece with a gorgeous slow moment. I mean, it's like an aria, but it's a real gem. Stephen combines an extraordinary amount of 
knowledge and understanding about the music with a sort of freedom of expression. Um, he's very much a, a sort of individual and extraordinary communicator. Johann Christoph Friedrich Bach was not an innovator like C.P. Bach. It's much more conventional, but it has its own quiet charm and it's certainly worth hearing. I remember liking it the first time I ever read it through. Just thinking, what oh, nice music, what lovely music this is. So my role in the sonata, um, well, it's a little bit like being a foot soldier, really. The, the only reason um, that the cello is there doubling, basically the left hand of the keyboard, the continual roll, is to add colour. If I'm accompanied by a harpsichord rather than a modern piano, yeah, it's very different the way one plays. One plays much more gently. I love it because the instrument, I can just let it speak for itself. I don't have to worry about being heard. Yes. Yeah, thank you very much. Thank you. Yeah. Bravo. 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 Bravo.